Hi, everybody. Welcome to the QB School, your home for the highest level of football analysis available anywhere. I'm JT O'Sullivan. Today, we're looking at our first Victory Monday part of a series. Why does Cam Newton look so impressed this year? I'm going to think it's the Norv effect. We're going to look at the same play, essentially the same play, this little double rub where Cam goes through the reads, doesn't get exactly what the concept of the play is called for. It's a man coverage play, but the read doesn't play out exactly as he'd like. They're trying to get this over route right here to Olsen. Doesn't get it, but he does a great job staying with it. He's patient, comes off to the rub. We're going to look at essentially the same play again later in this quarter. This is a quarter where they do a great comeback against the Eagles. They're down 17. Norv gets him into plays he feels comfortable with. Easy reads, great completions, great job, high-level quarterback. We're going to look at the Norv effect today and Cam Newton. Welcome to the QB School. So out the gate right here, I'm going to get a great man zone indicator. Carolina does a nice job. Norv does a great job right here. You get a runner across. You can already tell when he runs with him. Middle field closed right here. Sure looks like man. 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 Great pre-snap indicators. Nice job play design wise to give the quarterback an idea exactly what's going on. We'll see him go here. There he goes. Now we'll get a chance Pause it right here to see concept-wise exactly what's going on. We're going to get a double pick, essentially. So you're going to get what's basically turns into an over, and then basically double pick where he's going to come set up in here, look like a little zone sit down, and you're going to get this guy running across. Now that's the primary read right there. Let's see if I can draw an arrow that looks correct. Try it again. Watch this. Let's see if I can do it eventually. got to get better huh I can do better there you go so the read essentially is one two and then you got a little check down that comes out here either a swing or a check down gives you a three so a little triangle then up top they actually end up running a go he actually ends up being a nice route here throws up the mailbox he's a winner too so you can alert that if you like it he might like it right there but so essentially it's a double pick man beater so you get the coverage you want here with man, but he's as he's running, he's at the top of his drop right there. That sure looks like a muddled mess. Now, theoretically, you could let hang with it a little bit, let Olsen come out of this. He probably still has him here if he waits, essentially second window throw against man, but he doesn't like it. The defense, 27, Jenkins, he actually overruns it safety-wise, and the guy who is the little pick rub right here, he's going to come in here and be wide open. Does a nice job getting it, spinning, getting upfield. So... Ends up being a nice play. The Norv effect here, in my opinion, is that Cam he's calling plays that Cam Newton's comfortable with and that Cam can read through. So he's patient back there, confident. He's not forcing it, not predetermining where he's going. This is a really nice job right here. Here we go. We see them run with the man. We know it's man. And we'll stop it at the drop so we understand his decision-making. So there it is at the top of the drop. Now that is a muddled mess. Again, Theoretically, you could hang with the tight end, Olsen, as he runs across. It's what the play is designed for right here. This guy coming across, you could hang with him and throw it out here and let him run a little bit into it. But he comes off of it, which is fine, to a better throw. Can't even see this guy right here. He's in here. He's going to sit right here. And again, Jenkins right here is going to overrun it. He's going to be the smart defender. He's going to be guessing, thinking that it's two unders, basically rubs. He ends up leaving him wide open. You can watch at the end of the play. He knows it's his bad. Everybody knows it's his bad. I used to have coaches that used to love to see defenders hit him on the chest, say, my bad, my bad. But right there, he threw wide open. Nice little job. So next time, now this is the fourth quarter again. We're still on a way of a great comeback. They get a chance. They're going to call the same play. Norb knows that Cam is comfortable reading this play. This is a great job by a play caller. So again, not the exact same formation, but the same play. So again, the through, the shallow, the rub or pick. So again, and then the check down. So you get a nice little triangle. Watch this. You get a, a one, two, three. Okay, so this is a triangle you always want to see as a quarterback, especially against zone defenses. You're trying to create that stretch on a, defend, a defensive zone. So right here, we'll be able to see it, and then you get a chance. Now this is a man beater, but because it's against zone here, Middle field closed, three deep zone. These guys end up running a little bit different route here, a little bit more nuanced, 
really subtle but easy things to teach and coach and see. So he comes across in zone. Now he wants to throttle down. He's going to come across, sit down again. But this guy who was number one against man, he would keep running. Okay, Here, he's going to throttle down right here. And you just put it right on him. Give him a chance. Get up the field. Easy completion. Get some extra yardage. But I love the Norb effect here of being able to call the same play, same quarter. Who cares? Get completions. So, something he's comfortable with. Easy. Out of his hands. There it is. Really nice job. From the back, we'll be able to see it again. The Norb effect is just giving quarterbacks confidence. We're going to call plays that you're confident with, that you can see. You can get the ball out. Plenty of time right there. Flip it to him. Really nice job. So I love the Norv effect here for Cam. He's obviously playing really well this year. Norv does a great job of bumping up that completion percentage, teaching you how to get the ball out of your hands, the essence of the play, trying to get it to a certain guy, but being comfortable going through the reads. So please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Ask questions. Get involved. And for the most in-depth analysis, please go over to the Quarterback School community on Patreon. Thanks so much for watching. I appreciate it.